Leos with Libras. That's one of the good combinations, actually. And I want you to check what, how someone affects you according to your ascendant sign. Say, if your ascendant sign is in Leo and you have friends who uh, are Libras, whose their sun sign or moon sign is in Libra, that's the best way to check. And then you can check your friend's ascendant sign or your lover's ascendant sign, uh, what you trigger in his horoscope through the, through the ascendant sign, uh, through your sun sign. So let me give you an example. For instance, say you are, your ascendant is a Leo. Uh, and to a lesser degree the sun or the moon because always the ascendant shows the relationships between people so it's good to compare your ascendant sign to others sun and moon but say your ascendant or sun or moon is in Leo and then you have a friend or a lover or a child who has their uh, sun or moon in Libra then this Libra person will trigger your third house the third house from the ascendant the third house from sun or moon but always the ascendant is the way to, to show houses most correctly you know so how will a Libra affect the Leo person well the Libra person triggers the third house uh, which is a house of siblings so these people who have very good friendship already you know Leos and Libras they can have much more better inf um, better friendships than other people and longer friendships and especially friendships that feel like sibling or relative uh, uh, friendships you know close ones and third house is house of adventure is the house of uh, excitability learning new things so it's great well, even if you're in a lot with a lover in a relationship uh, the Libra will help the Leo will help the Leo stimulate will stimulate in the Leo person their sense of adventure. Third house is adventure. Third house is experimenting, trying out new things. So the Libra will stimulate this desire to try out new things in the Leo person and make them more adventurous, more even a bit more liberated, a bit more playful. Third house is the house of games and playing. Uh, and uh, uh, the Libra person will have this influence on the Leo person, will help them become more curious about life, more curious about the facts of life, more curious about um, uh, the world around them. It might be even news or it might be magazines, so it might be that the Libra person brings into the life of a Leo person some new information or something new, curious and interesting that stimulates the mind of the Leo person and that stimulates the desire and excitability of a Leo person to open up them, themselves, learn something new, become, you know, more curious, childlike. Third house uh, is, a child, is a house of children, is a house of, of plays and games and learning new things, you know. So this is how Libra will affect the Leo person. And actually Leo will have great fun with the Libra person. And Leo will feel a strong connection, friendship connection to the Leo person, whether it's, whether it's lovers or whatever, you know. Uh, and third house also rules courage. Uh, the ability to be initiative as well. The ability to start something on your own uh, and to tackle on difficult tasks. Uh, and uh, learning anything new, like learning to play, to dance, to swim, is a difficult task, especially when it's practical skills. And a liberal person can be a great teacher for a Leo, or can inspire Leo to want to learn any one of those new things, an so instrument, or knitting, or playing football, or, you know, anything which requires new skill, or learning how to do internet, or how to make an email. A liberal person can be a great teacher for a Leo person. Skills, when it comes to st skills, to, to teach the Leo person some practical skills, or some new experiences in their life of more practical nature, uh, you know, of, of uh, more interactive nature as well. While, uh, huh, let's see, uh, while the, also the liberal person can help Leo start something new, as I said, initiate something new and uh, be more courageous. You know, so because trying all those new different things requires you to be courageous, requires you to be more adventurous. And the liberal person will influence the Leo person in this way by triggering the third house, by, by bringing this influence more strongly into the life of a Leo person. Let's say you're a Libra ascendant and to a lesser degree Libra sun or moon. Then the Leo person will trigger for the Libra person the 11th house. So the 11th sign from Libra is Leo when you count and the 11th house in astrology rules friendship so again you see third house rules sibling relationships so it's very close to friendship 11th house rules more 
more like brotherhood friendship, more like a more evolved friendship. So again, a Leo, uh, again, a Libra person, a Leo will stimulate in the Libra person the desire for friendship, the desire for social connections. 11th house rules networking and social connectivity uh, and rules bigger groups of friends. So uh, a Libra person can introduce a Leo, the opposite, Leo person can introduce a Libra person to a bigger circle of friends. Uh, can expand, can bring some new people into the life of the uh, liberal person, can um, introduce the liberal person to some benefactors, the 11th house rules, benefactors, people who like us a lot and who help us. Actually, the liberal person can be, uh, the Leo person can be such a person for the Libra for the Libra person, whether it's your lover or your friend or whatever, the Leo person can play the role of a benefactor who helps you further, who helps the Libra person further their goals and um, their uh, plans for the future. Because 11th house rules your goals and dreams, the ones that you slowly try to take uh, to work on over your life, you know. So, such, so Leo person helps the Libra person get there, sometimes by negative example, and by doing something wrong to the Libra person that puts them where they where they want to go, sometimes by introducing them to someone or by good example, by by the Leo person being themselves the benefactor for the Libra person, uh, and uh, also. Uh, 11th house is house of gains, astrologically speaking. So um, if you want to go into a business partnership and you have your ascendant in Libra and a Leo person, person with sun in Leo or moon in Leo comes to you or ascendant in Leo, then you can quite be quite sure that uh, you can go into business partnership with this person cause, or uh, have some business deal or something because they will be in some way gainful for you. You know, and uh, or some, sometimes you might be wondering, will me and this person have financial problems? How will he stimulate me if we start living together? You know, uh, or if I accept this person, well, this person will either introduce you to new people who are beneficial for you. If you know, if this person is Leo and you are Libra, or they will be in some way beneficial to you by helping you improve your gains financially in some way as well. So as you see, the influence is not so erotic and sexual, you know, it's much more friendship, mutual benefit, opening up, expanding each other's mind, you know, expanding the circles of knowledge, expanding the circles of acquaintances and friendships, how they affect each other. But it's, it's called the very friendship and easy relationship between people. And uh, even sometimes, even if those relationships are not easy, uh, after you finish a relationship with someone, you will see that this person contributed or helped you expand in that area of your life somehow or brought those areas of, of, of the 11th house if you're a Libra uh, into your consciousness or the third house if you're Leo uh, with the Libra into your everyday world, you know. So it is interesting interaction. Um, it's, it's a good match overall. Um, and even if it's a short match, even if it's you meet just for a day or two or a week, this is, this is how you affect the influence each other. Libras uh, influence Leo to open up their mind, to learn something new, to be more curious, to be more expansive. While Libras, um, while Leos stimulate Libras by maybe introducing them to people, maybe helping them progress further with their goals and dreams and by helping them become more gainful. Thank you.